Well, hello, and welcome to my final video of 2021. I know, we have reached the end of a pretty crazy year, I think, as I do at the end of every year. I'm going to review my computer setup, tell you what's changed from last year. Yeah, maybe it's a little bit of a flex video. It, it very well could be a bit of a flex video, but I'm just going to be here to show you what PC I'm rocking nowadays. Um, it's not changed completely, just a few little little minor changes here and there uh, to tell you tell you where I plan to take the channel next year and uh, what content you can expect to see. So I think without further ado let's just get into my PC build of 2021. So it is widely unchanged from last year same case the Carbide Series 275R in white um, this thing right here you can kind of see it on screen actually this this PC has been Wow, what a workhorse for me. It's, it's, it's done a lot, and it will continue to do a lot, because I'm not getting rid of this thing for quite a while. Uh, so I'll quickly run through the specs with you. We've got AMD Ryzen 7 2700X at 4 GHz. We've got the Corsair Vengeance LPX DDR4 16 gig kit. Not on DDR5 yet. I'm not riding that train yet. I don't need to, I, in my opinion. I think I'm doing pretty well so far. For our graphics card, we're actually using a GTX 1080. Now, this is something I do want to upgrade to a 3070 at some point. But I'm sure if you've looked at PC part prices, getting a graphics card, particularly a 3070 or any of the new 30 series, is near impossible without paying a massive, massive upscaled price because of how rare these cards are and how many crypto miners are just buying them all up. An ASUS Prime X470 Pro motherboard. A power supply, it's just an EVGA Supernova one, 550 watt. For storage, this has probably changed the most this year. I think I've got two new drives so we have the 500 gig ssd that i started with and then i bought a one terabyte ssd for my games specifically it's the samsung evo what a what a baller that is and then we've got a three terabyte hard drive a one terabyte hard drive which were already in there before this year and then i recently brought an eight terabyte hard drive purely for video stuff eight terabytes purely for video um hopefully i don't fill it up within a year because that would be pretty sad and then obviously case and then i've got three monitors now Three monitors, I think I did have these last year, but we've got the two HP Pavilion 22 CWs that I've had for years now, god damn. And then we've got this lovely Acer Nitro monitor, I can't remember the exact model, but it's 144Hz, it's beautiful. And then I've got the Corsair Strafe keyboard that I've had for years as well, Cherry MX Browns, love it. Love, love or hate Cherry MX Brown switches, I quite like them, I like the keyboard, I think it's very cool, I don't need to change it yet. It has it's had a lot of coffee spilt on it and it's still going so you, you gotta rate it really <laughs> it is still going and then for the mouse we've got the Corsair Scimitar Pro RGB what a lovely mouse I actually use both these buttons on the side I know it might be a bit overkill for some people but having all these like macros I can I can do oh it's wonderful the headset is the SteelSeries Arctis 5s that you've seen me use for oh, right two or three years now and then the new Air NW700 condenser mic, which is this bad boy right here. I don't think I need to change it yet. Obviously, there are better mics out there, and I am looking at possible upgrades for when that time comes. But for now, I like this mic. I'm going to keep using it. Um, I don't see a need to change it just yet. Actually, yeah, one of the big upgrades I forgot to mention is I'm now filming with a GoPro. Yes, that is my new camera. It's linked to a Camlink 4K. Got that on offer from Elgato. I can't remember what deal they were doing but it was hella cheap in comparison to what they're usually worth so of course I slurped that up and I slurped up this GoPro 4 from eBay pre-owned works wonders look look at me I look, I look beautiful <laughs> um, and then I've got my hate my Elgato HD6 over there which I don't really use that much because I'm trying to get a can uh, the 4k version which just slots into your PC which is much easier than having an external one I, th I think anyway personally and then obviously I've got my Nintendo switch been playing the new Pokemon game on that is brilliant um, it's just nice to just kind of play the game without having to film a video, you know? I've got my Xbox One controller, which I brought off eBay pre-owned, um, which I used to play FIFA and GTA and stuff. And then I have a Wacom drawing tablet. I can't remember the exact model, but it'll be on screen. Um, I use that for my art stuff at university. Yeah, it's, it's dope. I got it real cheap from CEX. Love it. <laughs> and yeah, that's... That's really it. That is my setup of the year. Uh, the cables are a bit messy, but I don't mind. 
Got these wonderful LEDs that my girlfriend got me. Lovely stuff. I have I have had to sell it to the desk because if you remember I moved my setup around. So they have had to be sell to the desk, but they work fine. So no complaints here. Got the ring light I've had for a couple years now. And yeah, I've just really jazzed up my room a bit. You got all these Area 11 posters. These shelves in the background. I built the AAT, which was which was up here. I built it. Um, I do plan to build these. When can I get time to go live to build the big one? That's that's what I'm waiting for. Um, that is the plan. There will be a day where I go live and I build the Republic gunship on stream. But I don't know when it will be. Um, so follow me on Twitter if you if you want to see that. I'll also put out a YouTube community post, I think, just to let people know that I'm doing that. Um, but th that still is the plan, okay? And then we've got some, some cool art over there. And this one. This this one in the background from the TF2 vinyl. It's the TF2 dudes playing poker. Very cool. So now that's all the way, I'd like to say thank you for 1.9k subs. That is very dope. Uh, the 1.9k of you have seen these funny videos that I make and you've been like yes I will subscribe so thank you for that um, TF2 Roblox really popped off on my channel so I'm going to do more videos on that don't you worry as well as a few more Roblox games that I've seen which are which are quite cool there'll be a bit more variety content on my channel this year or next year I think mostly TF2 of course there will still be the TF2 content but I do want to play a couple more games on the channel even if it's just for a one-off video because I, I do have fun on other games and maybe they translate well to a video. I mean, my crab game video did really well. I wasn't expecting it to do as well as it did, but I did have the hope of uh, the help of other TF2 creators in promoting my video. So thank you to you. Um, I'm just thankful to all the community products I could get involved in this year. And yeah, it's just been a really fun year making videos, playing TF2. Uh, the game still going strong. No major updates, but you know what? We move in, we move in. And yeah, it's been really fun. Big things planned for next year. I don't want to spoil anything. The videos may be a bit slow up until summer. And then I'm going I'm to increase the rate. And I'm going to increase the quality of those videos. Because I'll be done with uni. I'll be finished for good. So I can concentrate more of my time on video creation. And just making stuff that I think will be fun to watch. Because that's why I do it. If you are looking forward to this next year of OGGT content. Then please do leave a like. Even if you're not, just leave a like. Because... I can't see dislikes, so just <laughs> just leave a like, you know. Uh, subscribe for the amazing content that I'm going to produce in 2022. Hopefully there are some big things coming. I've got plans, but I need to put them into fruition. I just hope the next year I continue to create the content that everyone wants to see. Happy New Year, and I'll see you in 2022 um, with some content. It, there will be TF2 videos, but there will also be other videos. So, without further ado... Goodbye. Or, or peace, as I would normally say. Hey, oh, uh, uh, I've been up for like two hours. Two hours. Yo, bitch can food took a few showers. Few showers. I don't buy my just money dance. Yeah. That wristwatch costs a hundred grand.